Yo, check it out. We're about to do another heat press review. This is one of the ones that are budget friendly and it's nicely, nicely produced. I know a lot of you guys like to start off with those Amazon heat presses, but those things are really clanky and it like falls apart really easily, buttons coming out. Let's go ahead and talk about pricing. I don't want to waste y'all's time. This heat press right here goes for $4.79. It has a special price of $4.79 right now, but if you stick around to the end, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can get the same heat press for $279. All right, so let's go ahead and talk about this Trans Pro Slide from Pro World. Now this is a 15 by 15 press. So this is 15 inches, 15 inches. Most t-shirt designs, you usually do around 12 to about 14 inches anyways. And sometimes we even go a little bit smaller. So this right here looks like it's about 12 inches wide and probably about two inches tall. So that's something that's just like across the chest, right? So this is a nice heat press that also slides out. So you can work away from the heat if you wanted to whenever you lay your actual garment down and you can slide it back in and lock it in place. So what I like about this heat press is that although it's budget friendly, the metal on it does not feel cheap. And that's my problem with most heat presses that are budget friendly. Let's also take a look at the display. So it has a nice and vibrant display. You can easily read the colors. As you can see, it's still heating up. It's about 270 degrees. It took about 12 minutes from the time that I turned it on to get up to temp. So it's probably gonna take around I'm gonna go ahead and turn off about 13 minutes or so to get up to about 300 degrees. So like I was saying, the numbers are really easy to read. The colors are well lit up. As the button's right over here, you hit set once. You can move the temperature up and down. You can set it right here. And then you have the times over here, which is the times before the actual timer goes off. So it's nice and straightforward. And what's pretty dope is the counter. You won't find that on most entry level heat presses. And I can't stress this enough, like the way this is built. Those really cheap heat presses are not built like this. And another thing is it does not come from a reputable company like Pro World. So you really have to take that into consideration when you spend those first few hundred bucks because you wanna make sure you spend it at the right place. All right, so I grabbed a t-shirt and a lot of you all always ask, can a heat press like this, a smaller one, an entry level one, handle something thicker like a sweatshirt or even a hoodie. This is about the same thickness as a hoodie. So I'm gonna show you guys if it actually holds up to it. Let's see. All right, so it is heated up. It's hot right here. So what we're going to do is slide it out. We're gonna lay our t-shirt. Lots of people do this different ways. If you start out as a screen printer, you probably want to do it this way. But the problem with the slide in is that it's gonna get caught right there. So I'm gonna do it this way. We're gonna push that in. It's a plastisol transfer. You can also buy plastisol transfers from Pro Row. Now, a lot of you guys always ask me, what's the time and temp for the transfers? Every single piece of transfer, no matter where you purchase it from, is always gonna have the application settings for it. But you can also find out more about application settings right here, proworldinc.com slash application. There we go. Nice little print. All right, so here we have a thicker garment. So I'm gonna go ahead and slide this in. Now the trick is a lot of thicker garments have the moisture in there. So you wanna give it a quick little pre-press and get that moisture out. See, the trick is also in the pressure when it comes to these thicker garments. You wanna loosen it up a little bit. That way it can still be nice and tight. But the problem is, the pressure for a t-shirt needs to be a lot tighter because you know the thickness is smaller, so it needs to clamp on a lot harder. But now that it's so much thicker, it probably won't close down. So what we need to do is loosen it. All right, now I'm gonna take this super color transfer, put it right here. Give that a nice little press, lift it up, slide it out, give it a peel. So the answer to your question, yes, it can do hoodies and thicker garments as well. That's a nice print.
All right, so check it out. I'm on the Pro World website. As you can see right here, it says save $200 on Mini Trans Pro heat press. And then once you come down here, you can literally save $200 off any heat press on here. Um, you have the regular Trans Pro right here. You can get it for $229. All you have to do is pretty much purchase $399 in stock transfers because you're gonna need this type of material anyways on top of everything. If you're going the sublimation route, you're buying some blanks, some digital art, or if you have a silhouette cutter, you can purchase some products for that as well. Now here's the Trans Pro slide, $279. Now if you wanna even get a better deal, all you have to do is come on over here. I'll put this link down below. And this one right here, you get the sawgrass printer. So if you wanna head into the dye sublimation route, which is honestly to me, one of the easiest and best routes to start making profits. But if you want to swap that out for an even nicer heat press, you can go ahead and click on this drop down box and you can go ahead and change this over to the Trans Pro Plus 16 by 20 semi auto heat press. Or you know, you can keep it at the one that's in this video, which is the Trans Pro Slide 15 by 15 heat press. So like I was saying, you can go ahead and opt in for this one right here, which is the 15 by 15 Trans Pro slide, or you can go ahead and click on this video right here to check out more about the Trans Pro Plus 16 by 20 semi auto heat press. But if you're ready to make a move, go ahead and check out the package. I'll have the link right below.